back and today I wanted to come in and do a talking video and share with you all a couple of things that everybody has been asking me all right so I just have to start off by saying I have watched <laughs> every single YouTube video there is out there <laughs> seriously for tummy tucks <laughs> yes I have I've watched all of the before and after videos as well. <laughs> they're getting good views from me. All the views that they're getting, they're coming from me. Because <laughs> I'm watching some of the same ones over. I'm getting all of my, any, any um, things that I had questions about. Oh, YouTube. YouTube tells you everything. <laughs> right? I've been watching live surgeries and everything. So that's what I've been banging out on lately. <laughs> <laughs> the tummy tuck and the breast lift surgeries that that's if you all want to know what I've been watching lately that's what I've been watching uh, pretty much around the clock so now I did find out that believe it or not for the surgeries surgeries with the s that I'm going to be getting done is just going to be three hours and I am totally 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 very excited about that it's only three hours because you know like some of the videos that I've been watching they say you know much longer some of them six hours this and that and when I talked to um, who's going to be doing my surgery they told me they said well I said well how long is it going to be and they said well three hours I said three hours right so excited and I said for both surgeries like three apiece right and they said no three hours together and I said well okay is he somebody else gonna be working on one thing while he works on the other and she said no he's he's good <laughs> and I thought okay that makes me feel great like every single person that I speak to every single person is like your surgeon is good and so that really puts my mind at some ease but on some aspect, my nerves is all over the place. <laughs> my nerves is all over the place. And y'all could only imagine some of the thoughts that I, that is going through my head. <laughs> and every five minutes when my husband sees me, he's been counting the days down. He's like, you got this many days? You got this many days? Are you ready? You got this many days? And I'm like, oh man, he getting me even more excited. So this right here, is please excuse the way I look guys I, I'm getting there by the time I go live tonight I'm, I'm gonna be there right now I'm just kind of I'm not really put together look at my shirt my shirts don't match but it's okay hey it's okay so they told me that something great for me to do they said because some people really after the surgery they really don't have an appetite they said, and if you're that person, the best thing to do would be drink a couple of protein shakes a day. So I'm going to purchase some protein shakes um, just in case, all depending on how my diet is. And then they tell you, they say, listen, when it comes to recovery, you're going to have an amazing recovery if you can eat a nice clean diet that is kind of salt free. So I'm going to make sure that I follow every single thing that they tell me to do everything compression socks I go and get fitted tomorrow at a place um, they're gonna fit me because I purchased some on Amazon and them things they, they fit kind of tight but then I was watching something and they said you can't do it yourself they said go get fitted for them so they fit right you don't want them to cut your circulation off when you wear them but you want that perfect compression so tomorrow I go get a second 350 nine inch four panel binder for my stomach I already have one but I wanted to have two just in case I gotta wash that one um, I'll have another one that's nice and clean and then when that one gets soil we'll just wash that and have the other one nice and clean so that's on my plans tomorrow and then also in my plans tomorrow is me and my husband are going to figure out you know we're, we're in a new place we're in a new place we need to figure out where the surgery center is so we're going to go tomorrow 
and try to make sure we can find it. She said, because you can't be late. <laughs> She's, you know, you can't be late. He scheduled the surgery, um, whatever, what is it called? The surgery center? I don't know what it's called. But he scheduled to have that operation room for three and a half hours. She's like, so make sure you're on time. Matter of fact, make sure you're early because he's going to have to do all kinds of stuff. So I think it's a great idea that we find this place that way on a day that it's time to get there. We're going to at least have an idea how to get there. So registration called me. Registration called me. Oh my gosh. And they um, asked me 101 questions and I answered them. And at the end, she said, you need to go get uh, metabolic. Uh, she said, have you had your metabolic done? I don't even know what metabolic is. She says, blood work. And I, I said, no. I said, but I can go today. She said, no, go tomorrow. <laughs> go tomorrow. Um, so I called my doctor. I told my doctor that I needed to get um, metabolic blood work done. So I did do that already. That's done. I hope I don't get, looks like I'm going to get a bruise right there, don't it? Man, I tell you, she woo, she took that needle and she really went in there. It was like she was digging for gold in my arm. And she said, honey, you okay? I said, I'm fine. <laughs> I'm fine. <laughs> so the blood work results will come back within 24 hours, which is great. Now, I, I have to assure you all of something. When I am recovering... I don't want anybody to have to worry about not seeing me. You're going to see me. You're not going to have to miss me. None of that. I'm not going to be in the kitchen cooking up any good foods for you all. But what I will do for you all, because I love y'all, excuse me, from the bottom of my heart, I'm going to be going live. I'm going to be going live every day if I can. And let's just say there's a day where I don't feel like it. I'm not gonna, <laughs> right? In hopes that the next day I'll feel better and I'll go live. But like I said, there's not gonna be any days where you have to miss me. I'm gonna, I'm gonna um, show you all uh, my whole recovery. I'm gonna talk to you all. I'm gonna be answering questions. I'm even gonna be answering holiday questions that you all have. I know you're gonna have holiday questions. And I, I know the questions, I, I'm, I'm going to go ahead and answer this too. So what are you going to do for Thanksgiving, Gina? I don't know. I don't know. I'm not cooking. I'm not cooking this year. This will be the first year that I haven't cooked Thanksgiving for me and my husband. Oh my goodness. Since 97. Oh, me and my husband has been together since 97 and I've made every Thanksgiving. Not this year. I'm not going to be in a position to cook. So we'll see what my husband comes up with because he, because he told me, he said, oh, baby, he said, listen, no worries. He said, I don't want you to worry about nothing when you're recovering. He said, I got you. I'm going to take good care of you and I'm going to make sure that Thanksgiving is straight. And I was like, okay. So I don't know what he's going to do, but this is going to be exciting. <laughs> but like I said, you all are going to have questions. And Jeannie Young's going to be available to answer your questions because, like I said, I ain't going to have nothing else to do but just be laying down in a bed recovering. So why not go live so y'all can talk to me, so y'all can chat with me, so you can ask me holiday questions and I can answer them live. Okay, so I'm definitely going to be doing that. I have still yet, I have still yet to do the before and after pictures. Um, and I feel like I'm going to do my before and after pictures tomorrow, tomorrow, Friday, tomorrow evening to be kind of not really busy. I don't know how, how this just happened. The whole pin just dug on it. I like this pins too. Uh, <laughs> um, what was I saying? I feel like Friday is the perfect day for me to do my before and afters. So I'm gonna give y'all some good before and after pictures that you can see, and we're going to attach it to my, um, what is it called? My post-op videos. Okay, so you're gonna get to see my stomach. 
Okay, you're going to get to see what was worked on and why it needed to be worked on. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. So, and then um, after the healing process starts and I'm able to take my binder off, I'm going to show you all my stomach and let you know, um, you know, if you're curious um, what I need to do to take care of the wound and all, all this stuff. Okay. So uh, this right here, it's, it's going to be a journey. But I tell you one thing. I just feel deep down in my heart and in my mind that God is right there with me. God is going to be right there with me. I'm going to have a successful surgery in Jesus Christ's name. Yes, I am. It's going to be successful and I'm going to be happy because there's never a day. That, let's, this might sound kind of weird. There's never a day that I don't look at my stomach and I say, Ugh, mm, mm, I, uh, uh. I can't do the big, I can't do, I got too much stomach and it must leave. <laughs> it must leave. The stomach has to go. The stomach has to go. So I have a lot of, um, I got a lot of stomach <laughs> and you'll see. And um, that's, you know, that's not a good feeling when you look in the mirror at your stomach and you say, uh-uh. You know, and here's the thing, if you are that person, then get it fixed, do something about it. You know, that's how I look at it, whether you work out or, you know, whether you do choose to do like I'm doing. Oh, yes, because I'm pretty sure they're going to take off at least 10 pounds or more. Oh, I bet you they are. And I'm so excited. I would love to ask them. I'm going to ask them. Can they show me? I'm going to ask them. Can they send me a picture of the skin that they cut off? Um, because I would love to have that picture to show it to you all. Do you all is that something that y'all would want to see? <laughs> I, I, I'm, I'm thinking of that, but I don't know if you want to see that. But I'm curious because I want to see it. And I want to know how much it weighs and all that good stuff. I want to know how much they took out of lipo and all that stuff. I want to know how much fat did y'all take out? <laughs> I want to know. I'm curious. So I know you can't take phones in there. Once you're in there the day of surgery, you can't take anything. You know, of course, no jewelry, no nothing, blah, blah, blah. So I'm going to say, can y'all take the picture? Send it to my email. Do something, because I want a picture. <laughs> Am I nosy? Okay, so now, those of you that don't know, or you may already know, Gina Young has been getting you all ready for the holidays since October. I've been getting you all ready since October. Normally, when I start getting you all ready for the holidays and doing amazing holiday videos, it starts in November and it ends like the day before Thanksgiving. Well, I started in October because I knew I was going to be getting surgery. So, um, and I feel like I've done an amazing job. And I want to pat myself on the back. You hear me? I have had such a great time sharing all of my holiday recipes with you all in hopes that you'll make these recipes for your family and friends and loved ones. And then you'll message me back and totally let me know what they thought about your holiday recipe that you brought to the dinner table, you know. And now the other day I made something really interesting. I made the hot caramel apple cider and it was a total knockout. I made the sweet potato pies. It was a knockout. The homemade baked macaroni and cheese, it was just a success. And everything, therefore, the one, now listen, some of these videos have been put in, I've been making them on regular videos, and then also I've been showing you holiday recipes on live. So if you click on live, you will see all the lives that I've been doing lately has been all holiday recipes. Now, if you want more holiday recipes, all you gotta do is click on Jeannie Young's playlist. On my playlist, you go to holiday playlist, an abundance of stuff, desserts and everything, it's all gonna pop up, Jeannie Young style. I want your holiday to be successful, and I want Jeannie Young right there in the kitchen with you, letting you know that you can do it as well. Anything I can do in my kitchen, you can do it also, and it's going to be delicious. And, and I'm just going to warn you now, whatever you take to your family's dinner table for this Thanksgiving, if you're using one of Jeannie Young's recipes, they're going to beg you for more. <laughs> they're going to beg you for more. 
Okay, Gina, when's the surgery date? The surgery date is November the 16th. November the 16th, I'll be having surgery. Yes, and I'll have God right there with me, right there on my side. You hear me? And also, uh, my husband will be right there with me. I was trying to figure out if we were going to send Dakota to school that day. My husband said he doesn't want him to miss school that day. But I'm trying to see what we're going to do. I'll have to really think about that. If I want him to be at home that day or if I want him in school. I mean, we can always let him in through the house. My husband can always uh, let him in through the um, security system. He can unlock the door from the security system. And he can come in and make him something to eat. But uh, we'll, we'll, we'll just see. We'll just see. I don't know if I'm going to send him or not. <laughs> My husband says, send him to school. <laughs> now, um, when I started talking about all of the recipes that I've made, there are, yeah, there are a couple of recipes that I didn't make. But for the most part, Gina Young has set y'all up. I have set you up for your holiday. And anything that you're looking for, it's on my playlist or it has recently been made. Go to my videos. Look at the videos. You're going to see all holiday stuff. Look at my lives. Go to the lives. You're going to see all holiday stuff. And guess what I'm doing Monday? <laughs> guess what I'm doing Monday? Monday, I am showing you all how to cook a whole turkey live. I'm going to do it live. Now, since I'm deciding to do it live, I'm going to have to do it early. I don't know what time I'm going to do it, right? Because I feel like I, you know, I would have loved to do it this Saturday coming up, but I've been unhad surgery by then. You see, so how the time is allowing me, I, I can only, I'm only going to be doing videos up until Monday, and then Wednesday I have surgery. So I'm going to sneak in a few more videos for y'all. I'm going to do the, the turkey live on Monday. I might have to do something like, say, do the live at 2 o'clock p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And that way I can have those three hours that it cooks. I, I, like, I want to show you in detail what you need to do from washing that turkey, cleaning it out, taking the giblets out, seasoning it, baking that baby. And I want it to come out of the oven right in front of you, and we slice and dice it. Okay, so, so the plans are in effect, and my mind is still working on what time Monday we're going to do this, okay? Because I know a lot of you have to work. So whatever we do, we're going to work it out with God on our side. I love y'all from the bottom of my heart. And as always, God bless. Thank you for watching. Good night. Oh, one more thing. <laughs> one more thing. Today, 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, November 10th, which is Thursday. Jeannie Young's going live tonight. I'm showing y'all how to make homemade eggnog. <laughs> yes, your girl's got you. When I said I got you, I got you. <laughs>